Well, made it to Vegas. <coughs> it's now uh, half two. So the wrestling should be getting here within the next half hour. Um, uh, I've just parked in the hotel. I'm going to throw my stuff up into the room if I can get checked in. And hopefully get a text or something from somebody to let me know where they are. Okay, checked in. Uh, we're up on the 20th floor. So, actually get a really nice view. Not of the strip. I think that's what they call a desert view. Don't know if there's more desert to one of the sides. It's sort of three, three sides to this place. And uh, yeah, uh, the wrestling just checked in down the lobby. So we're gonna meet in about an hour after they get a shower. Uh, but they're all wrecked after their flight, like I was a few days ago. But I'm fine now. And um, gonna meet down the lobby and head up to register at the uh, the Hilton where the competition's taking place. So this is where all the taekwondo starts. Let's go, Alright, well, we got to the hotel, got registered, got myself a free bag, and uh, we're competing on Friday, it's Tuesday now, Garth's competing tomorrow, uh, but we're going to spend the next few days training here, so it'll be an early start every day for the next few days, uh, I think we're going to be over here for about 8 in the morning, and uh, yeah, so we're going to get some lead now, get, everybody else is going to head back and just crash, so uh, I'm not sure what we'll do with the evening yet. Uh, I may actually walk back in here just to see the strip from this end. I've walked a strip from the Bellagio south, but this is way north, so it'll be good to see the strip from this end, and I'll probably have walked most of it by then. So I might give that a go, or I may just go back and get an early night. Well, I'm walking back anyway. I decided just to see the strip from this end. Uh, when I was here before, I walked from the Bellagio south, so this will take me from uh, when we went south as well, we went pretty much as far as it was as far as you could go to see anything. Uh, so this time we're, or I'm going from probably as far north as you need to be to see anything, back down to where we're staying, Monte Carlo, which is a little bit south of Bellagio. And uh, yeah, so no idea what that thing is over there. It's pretty impressive, but. It's, uh, it's about an hour's walk according to GPS. I think it'll probably take about 45 minutes in reality. And uh, so far it's been a wee bit barren. I think most of the, the sort of life in the strip is down around the Bellagio, sort of more centered. So it hasn't been much up this way so far. But it should pick up. All right, this is one annoying thing about walking around in Vegas, is that I walk down the street. I want to get over there, straight across, but I have to go up here, across the bridge, down the other side for some reason. It's just like, that's why it takes an hour instead of 45 minutes. from day one in Vegas. Uh, after I got back from the walk down from the Hilton we uh, went to the buffet and I ate way way too much. Uh, it's like two dinners worth and then a dessert. But uh, we're, I think everyone, everyone else has just gone to bed now and because I adjusted to the time zone here a bit better uh, I can stay up a wee bit later but it's going to be an early start for everyone tomorrow. Uh, we're heading to the Hilton for about eight I think. Um, so there's only one competitor tomorrow, Garth's competing, he's fighting, and the rest of us will just be doing a lot of training tomorrow. But it'll probably be a long day, because the competition goes on till about 8 o'clock. So I don't know if we'll be stuck there right to the end, uh, if Garth ends up go through to the final or anything. But it'll, it, it'll be a long day. Tomorrow for us is the start of the US Open, 